Hi there, and welcome to Unclassified, where our horror is your entertainment. Today I'm going to spice things up a bit and tell you all a story about how I robbed the shop when I was two years old. Yep, that's right, little me a delinquent out there robbing stores every single day of my life. Yeah, no, that wasn't, that's not true. But anyway, before we start, I just want to say thank you for 50 subscribers. I mean, we've passed that now, we're about 60 something, but I cannot believe I hit 50. I, I checked, it was actually... I left it one time, came back to it, and boom, 50. So, thank you for that. But anyway, let's get straight into the story. Now, before I start the story, I want to say sorry for the low quality audio, because I am not home at the moment, and I'm recording this off my phone. Okay, so this story takes place when I was two years old. It was in somewhere, sometime in 2004, and what happened was, I was out with my family one day, and we were, I think went to my one of my family member's house, I don't know which one, but what I remember was we were near a shop and we were standing outside and I was speaking to my dad and I was like, dad, can you go buy me a magazine? I want a magazine. Hop to it. Not really, but I was two years old and this is what got told to me anyway, so I don't know if this is all true. I don't know if all this is true, it's just what I've been told, so I said to my dad, can you get me a magazine? I want one. And he said, no, if you want a magazine, go get one yourself. Pretty selfish in my opinion, but I took his advice and apparently... I crawled, not crawl, I could walk by then. I walked across the road, when there was probably traffic, you know, I, I didn't know, look to my lefts and rights by then. I probably got run over 16 times and don't even know about it. So I got across the road and apparently I snuck through a fence, like the back fence of the the, um, the shop and I crawled in through the back door and apparently I just went forward. No one saw me by the way, this is, this is shocking. So I picked up a magazine and I just walked straight out. Like this is probably back when um there was no security camera. Actually, no, there would have been cameras back then. This still makes no sense. How did I not get caught? I would have been a master criminal. I should rob a bank one day. Okay, that was a joke. No one take that too seriously. But, um, yeah, so I took the magazine, went back out, went through the fence again, called back over the road, and I went to my house. I was like, Dad, look, I got a magazine. He was like, where the hell have you got that from? I was like, you told me to get it. But I was probably a kid, so I was like, you told me to get it. So then my dad took me across the road to the shop and he walked in and he was like, I'm so sorry, my, my son robbed this magazine. I'll pay for it now. And he's like, wait, when did he rob that? I never saw anyone coming here. Because obviously I snuck through the back door and I snuck back out there. And he, was like, he was like, when did he do that? He was like, I don't know, he just did it. He came up to me and showed me. He was like, oh my God, that's a master criminal right there. We could hire him in 16 years and he can, he, he can rob banks and get away with it. Again, just a joke, maybe. You'll never know. But uh, yeah, at the end of the day, win for me lost for him i still came out with the magazine at the end because my dad paid for it and i learned my lesson huh <laughs> not i still got the magazine so uh but anyway time to be a, an adult about this now if you're thinking about robbing a shop just don't do it if you're gonna do anything like that just, just pay for your stuff okay you know, unless you're two years old then you, you best just get away with it okay i'm not being very smart right now okay don't rob shops just don't do it it's not worth it okay anyway that's basically the end of the story. I came up with the magazine in the end, you know, win-win for me and lost for him. Now then, thank you for watching the video. If you liked the video, then like the video and subscribe if you know one else. See you in the next video. Goodbye.